Hello. I was just reading an article in the Yahoo News today, Yahoo 7 News, that Carl Williams, um, a gangland figure in Australia, has been murdered in um, a maximum security prison. Um, I think called Barwon Heads or something. Uh, let's see. It says, Carl Williams bashed to death in jail. Now, the fella um, was in maximum security. You know, that's like segregation. Um, the, the article talks, yeah, Barwon Prison, west of Melbourne in Australia. Um, but, you know, these maximum security prisons are supposed to be maximum. I mean... Uh, maximum control, maximum everything. Now, apparently someone got a, a bike handle. One says one of the in, other inmates has walked up behind Carl, struck him to the head a number of times with a heavy instrument. Um, they reckon it was a push bike handle or um, the, the bar that goes down that way, one or the other. Now, anyway... Um, the man was in uh, Underbelly. I don't know. I'll cut to a different thing. Underbelly, there's a show called Underbelly on the 101 network we're watching in America. Now, we've been watching Tale of Two Cities. They're talking about Robert Trimboli and um, all the other gangland people that was going on back in the 70s and 80s. Now, apparently, um, Carl Williams had been jailed for maybe the next 36 years, I think it was, for the killing of, let's see, Moran's or something, their last name, Moran. I, I couldn't really tell you their names right now. When I was living in Australia, there was a few murders going on, you know, a per person come up to your car, bang, you're dead. Um, so two brothers, by the what I can recall when I was living in Australia, um, got killed, and I think another person too um, was murdered, and there was a lot of gang, you know, gangland type murders going on. I'm not sure if it was over drugs or if it was um, other issues, but usually um, nowadays it's over drugs, murders, and um, or whatever situation it is that goes on. But anyway, Carl Williams, um, an actor, played him on a series called Underbelly. And anyway, he went to jail in the series. Now, um, the real Carl Williams was in a maximum security prison. He has been murdered. A um, couple of whacks to the back of the head. Um, cardiac arrest. So I guess in maximum security prisons... There was probably a hit out on him. Maybe someone made an accusation of, you know, $800,000 for anyone who could take down Mr. Williams. Um, there are victims involved in all this, you know, but we won't get into it. Um, they say here that a guard was standing about 10 metres away um, on here. So... Anyway, um, the the bloke Carl Williams has been dead, or is dead now. Um, his father is probably in, you know, upset right now. There was another bloke here anyway, um, Mick Gatto. Mick Gatto um, said he had little sympathy. You know, whoever Mick Gatto is, well, you know. They, you know, he's probably a part of all this um, underworld figure stuff that they've talked about on TV in the TV series. Um, I don't remember too much about it, but it just says that he, that um, Mr. Williams or Carl Williams, he pleaded guilty in 2007 of murdering underworld figures Jason Moran, Lewis Moran, and Mark Malia, 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 Malia. Anyway. Um, he was also convicted of murder of drug dealer Michael Marshall and multiple drug charges. Um, you know, so anyway, I just thought I'd let the people who understand all this underbelly stuff that Carl Williams, um, 
has died in prison, what I can gather. I'll try to post this little article if it will win, or most of it anyway. It says, just says, gangland killer Carl Williams has been bashed to death, allegedly by a fellow inmate at a maximum security prison, while the prison guard was just about, it was just about 10 metres away. Uh, Williams suffered serious head injuries after he was struck several times with the stem of an exercise bike at about 12.50 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Monday. Um, it says the man who ordered some of Melbourne's most brutal underworld killings was sitting at a table when he was hit from behind with an in, in an exercise facility in the Acacia unit of the high security Barwon prison, West Melbourne. So anyway, I guess that, you know, no matter where you are and you're involved in those sort of areas, some will, someone will get to you in the end. I'm sure that even the other person, Martin Bryant, who went around killing people in Tasmania, which is another story, but anyway, um, someone will get to him one day too. Unfortunately, these things go on in the world. Um, happens all over the world in many areas, but, um, you know, Carl Williams, as the article says, is bashed, bashed to death in jail. Goodbye. This is Men's Help TV.